please. We go to our relationships to give and to fill up. They are our fuel. They are our foundation of our life. And we're going to teach you how to build a strong foundation that's not surviving. It's actually thriving. So really exciting. Um, Just as you spoke to before about the dynamics of change in a family, like going back to our parents' generation, the men typically worked and the mm. women stayed at home. Mm. But over time, that's really changed. And now we've got a generation where both parents are mostly working mm. and both are also trying to juggle the kids and all the household responsibilities. And it creates this real blending of the masculine and feminine roles. Yeah. There's not a clear line in mm. the sand as to, okay, the man does this, the woman does this. Mm. You're constantly, I find myself, you've got to be able to go in and out of masculine yes. feminine very effectively. And if you don't know what they feel like and how to embody them, it creates this real... It's hard, it yeah. It creates a depolarization of the, the attraction between you two. Definitely. So we'll go into that in more detail. Yeah, and the, the same is true for women. So mm. women are doing this dance as well. Women now have businesses. They're now working yeah. more, and that's great, mm. but we don't have to do it like a man does. We can do it in our feminine. And, and it's being, more powerful. It, and more powerful, exactly. I still use my masculine as a tool, but I now live mainly from my feminine. And I have more energy because I do that. And, you know, that's the key for the men as well. Mm. Living from your masculine and using the feminine as a tool. And we'll teach you how to drop into that in a really easy way um, so that it, it just it, it de takes the complication out of it. It becomes really easy for you. Um, so we're going to spell that out so easy for you. You know, we're both under a lot of stress in today's world as men and women because we're holding mm. a lot. 